It's a storm coming, Harry. Just like last time. Harry. How did you get into editing? I, uh, I started off at the BBC in the film library at Brentford. Uh, got a job in the vaults there um, when I was about 20 or so. And then from there, I got on to the... I was told that you could apply for the trainee assistant. Now, my dad was a cameraman, so... Right. So I was kind of torn between, at first I thought, oh, obviously I'll go into cameras, but I'm, I didn't, in the end I thought, no, I don't want to do that because my dad was quite well renowned, you know, well thought of cameraman. And I didn't want to go in there and people say, oh, the only reason he got it was because his dad was a, a DOP or whatever, you know, that would have been awful. So then I met someone, uh, a guy called Ian McKendrick at the BBC, and he was really friendly and helped me and he let me come into the cutting room because I, I kind of went down a corridor of a cutting room once and I saw all these rooms with all these people working away and I thought what on earth's going on here and you heard all that what do you, mean? you know and all the yes. and the film and the mag going through and I thought oh god I really like this this is really interesting so um so I applied for the trainee assistant uh, editor's course at the BBC which was amazing um because you got to work on so many different genre of, of productions you know you could work in children's you know religion if you wanted to current affairs music and arts drama you know science all those kind of different things you could do and it was it was just it was like a massive film school and and so many of us went went there like colin and people like that you know we all went through that and we worked with a guy called bernard ashby as well at, at ealing studios and we learned how to track lay and become sound editors there because in those days the assistant would do the track laying as, as all you guys know so you know you learned about sound and then you got into editing so that's that's the way i did it you know it was a brilliant brilliant way of learning and you yeah. work with all these different editors senior editors who were who taught you and and you and you through osmosis of being in the cutting room you would learn things and and you work with all these different directors and so lucky to work at the BBC. It was brilliant. 